Hey guys, what's up? Team Doc here today with a track review. Today I'm reviewing the new one from Tardia. It's called Dead Promises. So when I first saw this, I was like, oh, Dead Memories, nice. A Slipknot cover. Or I thought like, oh, nice, we already have one of those Dead Memories. Uh, the second one was just a joke. I mean, everyone can have the same titles. It's like these guys and Morbid Angel, they have songs called Suffocation, but they're different anyway. Topic at hand, talk about Tardia. Okay, so first of all, when you um, listen to a Tardia song, you already know that, that it's Tardia alone, that it's not with Nightwish. It's not something that... Um, it's now one of the Nightwish songs from the Tardia era. Now, of course, you know this if you're a Nightwish fan or if you're a Tardia fan. Okay, so... <clears throat> yeah, uh, so there's a big, big example when you hear um, Tardia in a Nightwish song. Sorry about that. In a Nightwish song, in a Nightwish song, I'm sorry if I keep repeating myself. It sounds real heavy, it sounds real power metal, but when you hear a regular Tardia song, it sounds um, more like rock. And Tardia, um, you know, her singing sounds a little bit more calm and a bit more dramatic. Nothing bad with that. Um, somewhat of a fan of hers. Uh, so yeah. Okay, and yeah, this one that promises it's really different, sounds like darker, more gothic. Starts out with heavy guitars, heavy, um, heavy instruments. And the vocals, the chorus, it sounds dark. It sounds like if Tarja is going to the dark side, you know, especially with her, with the other track I had reviewed of hers, O Tannenbaum. It was Christmas, a uh, Christmas song, but still she sounded dark in that one and looked dark in the video. But yeah, you hear this one, and, you know, she's going to the dark side, the dark side of metal. And you know what, That that's awesome, and I really enjoyed it, the instruments, uh, you know, had you headbanging. Yeah, when you're listening to Tardia, um, you know, you're just there, you know, bopping your head, enjoying the beat, the rhythm, and all that, but... With this one, that promises, it sounds fucking awesome. And yeah, a little bit less dramatic um, on her voice. That's how I see it. Okay, so guys, tell me you, tell me what you guys think. Um, see you later, and as always, keep it metal.